forget. God declares the end in the beginning. The beginning of the church age or the dispensation of Christ under the new covenant began on the day of Pentecost when they were filled with the Holy Ghost. And those that were attracted to them cried out, What is going on? We heard your message. What shall we do? And the Apostle Peter said, The first thing you're going to have to do is recognize that the generation that you are in, the religion you are practicing, the lifestyle you are pursuing, the legalism that you're embracing, is going to damn your soul. So save yourself from this untoward generation. Now before I get in trouble, throw my little old brother jump on my back and say, but he also said, and many other things, yes sir, he said many other things that these people should do, but he did start out with the profoundness. Before the many other things can be implemented, you are going to have to save yourself from the corruption, the pollution of religion, from the hierarchy of politics, all the things. You know, I'm, I stand amazed sometimes. Oh, by the way, this is Brother Stair. I am again standing alone in the small radio room here in South Carolina preaching on the profoundness of a worldwide network of stations that touches and reaches every nation in the world. Still it does not impress people. The fulfillment of the prophetic utterance of the question, when shall these things be? What shall be the sign and then the time I get to that I gotta pause because most people are not expecting the sign so therefore they are putting off or going around trying to find some other thing to occupy their time instead of looking watching for the sign if you therefore will not watch then you will not know in what hour the Lord doth come? What are we watching for? The sign. And then shall appear. And then shall appear the sign. Not the coming of Christ, but the sign. Oh, God. Oh, how people rage on me. How they rage and rage and rage. Once not know to get cause himself prophet. He's no more, but you know, he's a prophet, all right. That sir used to try to call me his friend before he tried to replace me and remove me. He said, Brother Stair, you need to get out of politics. My God, man, how could anybody listen to me and tell me I'm involved in politics? For years and years and years and years, I've told people we do not 